Hi, welcome back to Panda Reacts. I'm Sandra and this is Ken. Hi. And Ham. And we're both going to be watching Ahsoka Season 3, Episode 3. So, last episode, a lot of stuff went down. There was the whole Macbeth witch thing with the new, with the mystery Jedi. Mm -hmm. Ken thinks it's... Ezra. Ezra. It is the last Inquisitor, right? I mean, I don't know. It just... Why not? <laughs> is it Ezra and he's been mind wiped it's or something? Not, but I'm just like, I'm pushing the limits. Or is it my go to Darth Maul? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That's just what I'm saying. I don't think Darth Maul would have to hide. He's I don't sick. know. I have no idea. Like, yeah, who's wearing that mask? Yeah, who forced the Sith, the Sith to hide? Nobody. I don't <laughs> know. And then you didn't notice that the, uh, what's the new galaxy called? That mystery galaxy. Yeah. This starts with a P. Slipped my mind. The Pergil whale galaxy. There. It had whales around the edge, or squid thingies anyway. It had, it had the space, space whales. whales. So I was like, that's the space whales. I'm still confused as to why everybody needs a map to find Thrawn. If you're working for Thrawn, don't you know where he is? I don't know. Maybe he's got an out of office message on what? there. Like, I don't know. That, that's Star Wars, man. You always need yeah, a, MacGuffin, <laughs> a MacGuffin to find something. You have to go first find the MacGuffin to find the thing that you're supposed to find, right? What the that's, hell's a MacGuffin? It's a it's a plot device where any sort of object becomes an avatar to like move the plot forward. Okay. So, yeah, you don't question things too much. Just yeah. enjoy <laughs> the ride. So Sabine finally decided she was going to be. Um, I guess, tamed enough to become the Padawan. And then I was also talking about how Ahsoka was acting towards Sabine was exactly mm -hmm. how an An Anakin treated her when she was a Padawan. There's some weird mm -hmm. rule, I guess, where you have to treat your Padawan like they know nothing. <laughs> I just call it patterns of abuse. It's just, yeah, it is <laughs> patterns of abuse. Um, the tracker is on. That's how they know they're at. The Cheeto planet, Seto, yep. and they've docked in that space station thing. Yeah. So that's kind of where they're at. Holding on to the giant, like, you know, giant, like, rocket engine that they brought there. So Well, that's yeah. on the, like, yeah, they brought the, I loved how Hera was all like, oh, uh, that's too big for all the ships that we have. What are you building it for? Well, that's classified. For the Empire! <laughs> <laughs> and I just watched, I rewatched. Mandalorian season three, one of the episodes today, it was the one with Jack Black, mm -hmm. and they said, and then they were like, "Oh, can I see that file? No, it's classified." I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> "Of course it is." It was the, um, it was when Paul's son Lee mm -hmm. finds the ship that that um, Moff Gideon was supposed to be taking to the jail, mm -hmm. but he got yeah, let out it. and then they were like what's the what's the deal with this ship oh it's classified what? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah i was like that ah, classified thing is again yeah this it's not right when it's classified because you know something bad's going on anyway uh let's see if anyone wrote anything on my oh wait we got to see like we got to see chopper who's a Oh, Absolute. I love it. It's Chop. It's not Chopper. It's Chop. He's a raging psychopath. That thing. No, he's not. <laughs> he's awesome. And the yeah. cat. I love Chop. I looked him up, man. He's a psycho. What? He's a murderer. What did you learn about Chop? He's a he murderer. Murdered? And, he, and he tries to hurt people all the time. And well, he, that maybe terrible. that's why his name is Chop. He's like committed a massive, massive war crimes. What? You're talking about Chop? Yeah. How dare you talk about Chop that way? <laughs> Just me, 4998. Thank you for responding and leaving a comment. Kurgan, I have something to say. It's better to burn out than to fade away. Yeah, maybe. I happen to agree. I'm a fiend for new and different colored lightsabers. I love the orange sabers. I love the silver, too. It's still newish. The girl's name is... Shin Hate. Oh, the, the, the Jedi. The blonde, like, yeah. Murdering they them. are not Sith. They are Dark Jedi. Okay. 
big difference there. These are Jedi who survived Order 66 and become mercenaries and keep, kept themselves hidden until Vader was long dead. They seriously didn't want Vader to find them. Yeah. <laughs> there would be none of that, would you like to be an Inquisitor sort of thing. No. Uh, they, he, he just, just killed, killed them. them outright. There's a lot in here that people who never saw the cartoons or read the novels wouldn't know, but they make it well enough that you don't have to for them to enjoy this show. It helps a lot, but isn't necessary. It's great to see you, Sandra. All right, thank you. Yeah, equals F equals MA. That's this dude here. Yeah. Happy yeah. Halloween, ladies. Yeah, I'm not reading your comment. <laughs> <laughs> Like I said, Qui-Gon is out there going, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I haven't, at this point, my episode two hasn't been, um, I, did I edit I haven't edited it yet and put it out. So I've got to do that, the vanel, then this one. So it'll come, it'll come. But uh, thank you for leaving that comment. Uh, yeah, I wish I actually knew more of the background. Mm -hmm. But there's been so many shows we've had to watch that my Clone Wars kind of, had to take a back seat and um uh definitely i could see how they'd want to hide from vader yeah i i really don't understand the difference between dark jedi and sith i'm not sure what makes a sith mm -hmm. and what makes a dark jedi so fill me in people this i do not know i'll just i'll just like my own video how's that I need five more subscribers to hit 600, and then I'll do a fancy butt dance. No, can't do it yet. <laughs> 600 subscribers. All right, well, I'm ready to watch the next episode, so let's go. Yeah, I, had, I checked up on, uh, on uh, you know, Generation Tech about Chop. Yeah, he's like, he's murdered, like, probably 100,000 people. Stop talking trash about Chop. <laughs> And he's like, he nearly killed Ezra a couple of times. Oh. And he purposely killed, like, you know, another robot that he was jealous of. Threw him out in airlock. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just let me love Chop the way he he's is. Terrible. He's terrible. <laughs> Chop has problems. That's all we know. That's what happens when you're a, you're a droid in Disney, you know, and Star Wars. The, the longer you last, the more weird you get. <laughs> but not good. <laughs> it's been a while. Obviously. Don't hold back, dude. I see you still remember the He never does. No, he doesn't. Enough to get by. Well, I discovered that according to Hu Yang, I'm the worst candidate to be a Jedi out of every Jedi he's ever known. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it doesn't matter. That's so mean. I think it does. Oh, it's oh. the shield mask, a la Luke. I can't see anything with the blast shield down. Now she's getting it. Oh, nope, maybe not. She's behind you. Chancellor Mothma, Senators. Mothma? Yeah, Chancellor Mothma. Yeah. Fine, Chancellor. In fact, he's on board. We have former Imperials working throughout every level of the new Republic government. All taken an oath of loyalty. Yeah, yeah, well. The Empire doesn't sound like the kind of loyalty we're looking for. <laughs> yeah. Involving Thrawn. Grand Admiral Thrawn. But how is that possible? He disappeared years ago. Well, the Emperor was supposed to be dead, too. Okay. <laughs> the Allies are working on a way to find him. Were you ever in the war, Senator? Did you actually fight? No. Ha! Then zip it. Grand Admiral Thrawn is dead. Well, show me his I'm body. Sorry to say it is my opinion that your friend Ezra Bridger heroically died with him. You don't know that. General. Hera. That went well. Hey, Mom. Mom. Oh. Is it true Lance Bean is going to be a Jedi? Now, where did you hear that? Chopper told me. Ah. Uh. Dang you, Chopper. Jedi? Yeah, I know you do, Jason. Jason? Well, I suppose you do come from a long line of non-traditional Jedi. In that way, she fits 
not to go down that road, shall we? Shall we? Status quo? Negative. No. Whatever it is has a signature which is unknown to me. It's a big ship. Yeah. Oh, hey, what's up? Don't get cocky. No, she just said good work. <laughs> she didn't Han Solo him. Her. I'm surprised you let them get this far. Stay clear. I should deal with them. Oh, well, how are you gonna do that, lady? Prepare turbo lasers. Turbo lasers? Great. Oh. Don't have an eye on cannon. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna have trouble. She just called like... her him Maroque. What do you want? What you got? Is this some weird, like... Oh, no! But they hit the Millennium pull... Falcon thing and... Yeah. Oh, no, they're still floating. Oh, yeah, pieces of it are falling. Ooh! Sweet. Come back. If I had a space fighter plane, I really wouldn't be getting close enough to get into the lights everywhere. <laughs> oh! I'm floating. There we go. I was just a floating there. Oh, no, 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 no. Whee! <laughs> That's pretty freaking awesome. Whee! Just gonna fly in this hole. Yeah, what is it? No. Is this space whale? Yes! Space whales! Space whales! You gotta get out of the way. Those things are dangerous. Space whale. <laughs> Damn it, there's so many. Ah! Pergola. Pergola. Pergol. Pergol. Whoa! Cool. <laughs> Whoa. Tentacles are difficult to navigate. Art of an asteroid field? No, probably <laughs> not. <laughs> A lot. Convenient. There are six hyperdrive engines in place, with the final one being set into position. So it is a hyperspace ring. Yes, but I have never seen one built on this scale before. Hmm. A craft with is there one flaw that could possibly lead to its total destruction? <laughs> a lot of boffins are going to have to die to get that plan? Zip it, I want to hear what he's saying. saw the awesome whales. Yes. I are we dramatically zooming in on his face? Because we're hunting them down. That that was why that was not needed the zoom yeah. on his face. I'm just saying. Yeah. <laughs> that was gratuitous. Gratuitous face zooming. Gratuitous
All right, episode three. When you, when I say space, you say whales. Space. Whales. <laughs> space pants. That's what I always think of when I say space whales. Okay, so um, some stuff went down. We got some, you know, a couple of New Hope throwbacks. We got the, the, the you know, blonde. Well, it wasn't exactly the shield. It was a face mask of sorts. The sucker was swimming in like yeah, in, New in Hope goodness. And, you know, <laughs> That's true. It really was Easter eggs and yeah, it was just yeah. It was crawling in them. Yeah. Uh, so Sabine had to reach out with the Force, a la Obi Wan and Luke, um, but Sabine doesn't seem to have. The force. So, you know, there's there's several theories on the force. You know, there's there's the one in New Hope where you just it, it's genetic, it's passed down. Which it is. And then there's the whole, you know, Phantom Menace Midichlorian thing. We shall not mention the Midichlorians. Yeah, I think we have to. <laughs> no. Because that they mentioned it was Grogu. Yeah. The reason they took Grogu is because he had off the chart midichlorians. So Basically, my theory, and I'm sure the real theory is, the more of those you have, the stronger the force you would be. That's just a huge retcon that's just bitter. You know, <laughs> because it's, it's genetic, dude. Yeah. So anyway, Anakin had tons. Luke probably had a lot, but that was never mentioned. Um, Grogu has a lot. Yoda probably had off-the-chart amounts. I think there's certain species that have more. And more genetic DNA samples that have more. Ezra, stop arguing with me, Ham. Uh, Ezra, uh, not Ezra, but Sabine, seems to want to be like a Jedi, but doesn't seem to have the stuff. So, can you train as a Jedi without really having the high, the, the predisposition to be able to use the Force? Because normally they're found like Harry Potter style, where you know, the kids use it earlier and they don't seem to notice they're using it. Anyway, mm. so um, there was there was her getting trained. Um, Hu Yang was being kind of a jerk, telling her she sucked and was the worst Jedi to ever be a Jedi in the universe. And that the Jedi Temple would never have accepted her. And I'm like, well, true, but they didn't want to they didn't want, didn't want to train Anakin. Mm hmm. Um, and you know, he got trained. Didn't want to train Luke either. Uh, Yo He's Yoda didn't want to train Luke. He's too old to begin the training. Yes. <laughs> and Ahsoka didn't want to train Grogu. There you go. So there's this, this thing yeah. about training, you know. Funny how no one wants to be a teacher Nobody these days. wants to teach. Yeah. It's Lousy just... pay. <laughs> no preparation time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Shitty working conditions. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, it sounds familiar. Yeah. Okay, so here's what happened in the middle of this thing. Anyway. Hera goes uh to talk talk to Mon Mothma, yeah. whoever her name is. Yes. And the, um, and the other side. She of was in the original trilogy and where and she was all dramatic about many mm -hmm. Bothans died to bring yeah. us this information. Hello. Yes, that was her. <laughs> Okay. I want to know who the Bothans are? They're gonna die for bringing the information for this for this space ring. Isn't that what Rogue One was about? Yes. The many Bothans that died. Absolutely. Anyway, okay. So uh, of course the senators were like, "Nah, politically this isn't a good idea. We're not yeah. giving you any things. We believe you're really wanting to try to find Ezra. He's dead. Uh, you're not really. It's not about Thrawn. You're just making that up. No, dudes." Didn't you learn from the Mandalorian when Moff Gideon and built the whole thing and was hiding and and they all and everyone was like, no, we don't want to send any ships, and yet Moff Gideon was there. Yeah. Haven't we already seen that there is like an organized like leadership Clearly. here? Because Moff already talked to them. Yes, <laughs> multiple times. All right, so in the afterwards, Hera comes out and Chopper, who I remember thought was that. just Chop, it's hey, Chopper. Remember that, like the spy lady. Yeah. 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 But she went and spoke to them. Spoke to who? The, the spy lady. The spy lady spoke to who? To the leadership. Just to Moff Gideon. Yeah. She didn't speak to the leadership. And then Moff went and spoke to Moff the Moff was talking to yeah. other dark dudes, right. and he mentions Thrawn. Yes. 
Yes, it's all tied together. Anyway, Hera's child is named Jason. Mm -hmm. One, he's not green or a Twi'lek. Let's just put that out there. Jason. Hey, people can be adopted. Yeah, wait for it. Jason is the name of Leia and Han's first son. He's a twin. His twin's name is Janna. The whole Ben Solo thing was dumb, but Jason, Han and Leia have three children. Jason and Janna and Anakin. What's with the, uh... So what's Jason... Did, I'm not... I'm not buying that that's just a throwaway. What's with the twin things in, in Star Wars here, man? Well, it twins run in Leia's family, so yeah. why wouldn't she have twins? Duh. I twin <laughs> no. Anyway, it twins run in families, especially boy-girl sets of twins. Those are genetic. Anyway, so Jason and Janna... My question is, is Dave Filoni giving us a little sideways, you know, was Jason hidden because he's Leia's son? Does Hera have him? Is there a back with Clone Wars to do with, the Her with Hera? Yeah, so I need to know about this whole Jason thing. Is that Hera's son? Is he adopted? Did he just, just show up one day? Um, where is Jason from? Hmm. I think he has a story. Um. So, what else did we do? Miss anything other than you t telling me that Chopper is a horrible, murderous rampage man? That kid was playing with Chopper. I'd be very worried. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't leave a child in that droid supervision. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know what's happened over the years with Chopper, but maybe he's mild manners. Oh yeah, let's talk about. The space whales. <laughs> so yeah, as, as they show, as they came up to the big hyperspace ring. So if you recall back in the prequels, Obi-Wan would have to dock his ship in this ring. And that was so he could travel hype by hyperspace because some ships don't have the drive. Yeah. So you dock your ship in this ring and the ring shoots Perfect. you into hyperspace. Public transport for hyperspace. Yeah. Or, you know, but this thing's like a giant Stargate. Mm -hmm. It has currently five hyperdrives on it. Yeah. Big, huge rocket things. And so how many ships are going to be moved in this? Like, are they going to move an entire army with this thing? I don't know. I don't understand. It, wouldn't those big ships already have hyperdrives? I'm confused. Where are they taking this thing? Where's the Master Chief? Yeah, so while um, Sabine and Ahsoka showed up at Cito, or Skeeto, Cheeto, planet. Cheeto um, they were under attack by Blonde Chick and Night Mask Man. And two flunkies. And three or four flunkies, yeah. who of course get to die. They get wasted. So then we get our next New Hope thing, uh, where... Sabine goes into the shooty thing, the and it's like, I got shoot. it! <laughs> don't and get Han cocky. like, you don't, don't get cocky, kid. <laughs> uh, so that was that part, and um, Ahsoka had to change her style and listen to Sabine instead of being stubborn and doing her way. She was asking Sabine, what should I do? What do you mm -hmm. want me to do? Yeah. Um, and that worked much better, because... Yes. Um, who Yang said, oh, we're just going to die because you two can't, like, figure out how yeah, to do things to together. Way. Meanwhile, he said that, surprise, surprise, the hyper ring's not complete. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure there's a flaw here somewhere and that the Bothans will have to die to find it. Um, so yet again, we've got something they're in the process of building. Yeah. Many Bothans have not died to bring us this information. No. So what... Where's the button to self-destruct? Because you got to put one on every single thing. Where's, where's the port that like leads directly to the reactor chamber? That will blow it up. I don't know. It's there somewhere. We just How have to do it. How are you going to hit this with proton torpedoes? I don't know. I don't know. Very carefully. Ahsoka and, Ahsoka and Sabine have um, hidden themselves in the forest of this planet. It's like a purple-reddish forest. Mm -hmm. 
and the rest of, it's like there was a bunch of ocean and um apparently there's the 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 paths that this hyper ring might be wanting to to go on are the paths frequented by the migratory like the whales. whales yes and i just didn't understand why if you had air superiority why you'd resort to ground troops to go and find these people in this giant forest when you could search them from high up? They couldn't because it turned all the power off so you couldn't like locate them. There's this one part where Ahsoka gets her spacesuit on and gravity boots and goes out on the wing with her two lightsabers. And instead of blowing the ship up, they're like, let's the bite, distance. let's get her! Let's get her into lightsaber range. That's a dumb move. That's a good idea. Dumb. And then she did this cool backflip thing a la mm -hmm. Rey and like sliced the wings off of one. Yeah. So I was like, woohoo! But then she ended up floating and she had to get... She didn't pull a Leia where Leia like flew. Sucked herself back like, with the psh. force. No, yeah. she just had... She just had... had she didn't like, waste her time. Ren moved the, moved the wing so that she could be yeah. magnetized to it again. So yeah, so magnet, boop, and then oh, away they went to the surface. Cause they, actually, they actually fooled the... They thought they they killed and destroyed the ship, mm -hmm. but because it lost power, they couldn't detect it. So it was just like floating there, and they're like, "Oh, nice try, Morgan. You almost got them." But they could see them. Ma, uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, and they didn't go to them right away either. They were like, "Let's just wait till they get their power back on, and then we'll try to shoot them." But that's the way it's supposed to be. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's the way it has to be, in order for people to have a fighting chance. Plot armor. Yeah. <laughs> Ten inches thick here. So yeah, what have did I miss anything else? There was a few lines that were directly like a new hope. Yeah. I was like, yeah. And that whole Mon Mothma thing reminded me of um when Paul Sun Lee went and asked Tim Meadows for some peop some troops and he was like Nope. No, not giving them to you. And then spy Moff Gideon chick was like uh, everything's peaceful. I don't know why you need any of that. I'm so glad to be working <laughs> for the New Republic now. It's liberated me. <laughs> yeah, right. We know better. So yeah, the Empire's never gone. It's just... <laughs> under there somewhere. <laughs> poking out. <laughs> All right. So... I can't, I don't think there's anything we missed. Nope. We rocked that hard. Anyway, leave us a comment. Tell us what we're missing. Let me know what you think about Jason. If there's some background on Jason, tell me what it is. Because all I know is that Han and Leia's son was named Jason. And that little boy had brown hair. It was a mini looking Han to me. So I'm just like, that's mini Han. And nobody cares about Ben Solo was not part of the books. Ben Solo was some made up thing. So I'm I'm hoping that they're kind of revising the storyline so they don't have to follow the weird path it took. That's just my opinion. So and bring in Luke. Come on, come on. <laughs> bring me my Luke. Stay calm. I need Luke. I was hoping the Chancellor was going to be Leia. I was like, is the Chancellor Leia? Is it Leia? Well, she's a, she's a general, so. General. Well, Je Han was a general in Return of the Jedi. Everybody gets to be a general, you know. But I think, was what well, was Leia in the Mon Mothma's in charge. later trilogy? She had some title. I thought she had oh, general, general as well. Leia, was she still yeah. late general? Yes. I don't think she wanted to be promoted. Although princess is more above general. Where do, so. you, where do you go above general? <laughs> don't know. Anyway, thumbs up. Subscribe. Get me to 600. That's what I want to do. 600. And we'll see you next week for episode four.